Now Nancy Pelosi's at it again. She's downplaying our booming economy. I want you to see this. Here she is. Watch. Hip, hip, hooray. Unemployment is down. What does that mean to me in my life? I need a bigger paycheck. This isn't just about the unemployment rate. It's about raise, uh, wages rising in our country uh, so that consumer confidence is restored because our co economy will never fully reach its um, uh, possibilities unless we increase the consumer confidence. Uh, okay, yeah. <laughs> Nancy Pelosi, I got a little note for you. Consumer confidence is actually doing really well. We're actually near an 18-year high in consumer confidence. So there goes that argument. Unemployment's at an 18-year low. So when she says, yeah, whoop de doo unemployment is at such a low, it is whoop de doo We should all be thrilled because we haven't seen levels like this in 18 years. And there are more job openings now than there are unemployed people. Tax cut bonuses. I mean, those have been massive. But oh, no, 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 wait, wait, wait. She thinks that that's just crumbs, right? In terms of the bonus that corporate America received versus the crumbs that they are giving to workers, this tax scam, which is a rip off of the middle class. Someone needs to tell her to stop. I mean, for the sake of the Democratic Party, because basically she's taking their platform and throwing it out the window. She has no solution to economic challenges. She doesn't care that the economy is improving. She doesn't even understand that we're at an 18 year high when it comes to consumer confidence. She doesn't understand economics and people vote their pocketbooks. So again, I don't care what they do, but if I were a Democratic strategist, I'd know exactly what I'd want to do. I'd want to find new blood. I'd want to find people that understand economics. I want to find people that understand what it's like to have to pay the bills each week. I'd find those people and I'd start having them talk about their vision for the economic future of America. And I'd have them say how happy they are to see that the job market is improving. And now, yes, we need better wages, but we've started to get that. And let's not forget, these things take time. We just got the lower taxes. Now we're seeing a pickup in GDP growth. We're seeing a better job market, and we're seeing consumer confidence at an 18-year high. Nancy Pelosi needs to go back to school and try Econ 101.